We are now into the busiest time of year at Orlando International Airport. Busier this holiday season than ever by as much as 17%, we're told. And we've been keeping an eye on the car rental situation at that new $3 billion terminal. We checked again today. It is still not fully up and running, causing a tough trek for many passengers. Yeah, and for the most part, you still cannot pick up a rental at Terminal C, even though it opened in September. So why is that, and when can you? News 6's Eric Von Aiken has been staying on top of the situation for months now. To be clear, everyone can drop off their rental cars here in the new Terminal C, no matter who they rented from. But still, Sixth is the only car company that is doing pickups here in Terminal C. And the airport tells me they still don't know when the other ones will finally come here. Hello. Setting up a rental car operation in a new parking garage takes time, the airport tells me. Car companies have to install their rental booths and set up the rest of the infrastructure inside the garage like Sixth has already done. How long will it all take for the other car companies to do the same here at Terminal C? Airport leaders didn't give us a timeline. The CEO only saying, quote, each on-site rental car provider is scheduled to implement full rental car services based on their specific operations, end of quote. We didn't realize that the rental car was going to be in a different location, terminal. a di different terminal. Yeah, it took us about two hours to traverse this. I don't know, there's a tram that someone told us about a little later on, but it was 11 o'clock at night. By the time we exited the rental car, it was probably 1.30. So your options are still limited if you're flying in to sea and need a rental car. Take the people mover tram from the new to the old terminals and walk the rest of the way, but that adds an extra half hour or so, depending on how much luggage you have and how quickly you can walk. The other option, the airport has put a shuttle in place and even moved it to the top of Terminal C. So you can board the bus on the same level where you arrive with less walking and no escalators or elevators. It'll take you straight to the rental cars at the old terminal. The airport CEO tells me that this wasn't how it was supposed to be. He says during the pandemic, they had to cut back on things like rental cars because of the uncertainty. He says now, though, they've been trying to catch up as quickly as possible and put things back into the plan, including the rental cars here in Terminal C. At MCO, Eric Von Anken getting results. News 6.